Welcome to Cloudy Knit Crochet. My name is Lori. I would love to crochet up a storm with you. So please subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Thank you. Before I start this episode, I would like to welcome all my new subscribers. Thank you for being here. And a special thank you to all my returning subscribers. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for supporting my channel. In episode 30, I will be sharing the Lether Collection Get Hooked on Sock Challenge and share some stitch markers that I purchased on their website. As you can see again, we're in the cat's domain again and Link is hanging out on my desk. He likes to look outside of the trees. I think he's looking for birds. Last night, they were um, both my cats were really excited and making these unusual noises because they saw another cat hanging out in our front yard. Today, I'm going to be opening a uh, Lether Collection box, and this isn't the subscription box that I get on a monthly basis. Uh, this was a pre-order that I purchased. Um, at the beginning of August, I believe, and it's called Get Hooked on Socks. And they're doing a um, crochet along, which starts on September 1st to make a pair of socks. And I know it's kind of late notice for you um, to begin this um, crochet along, but they do have this kit on sale that you could purchase and make these socks up on your own. So let's go ahead and check out the yarn. I've never made crochet socks before. I do know that when you make socks, you have to use a really fine yarn. So let's take a look at that yarn first. So that's how fine the yarn is to make socks. This uh, hand-dyed yarn is called the Dragonfly Wing Sock Set. 85% superwash merino and 15% nylon. The um, big skein is 400 yards and then the mini skein is 92 yards. And the mini skein, um, you work that up when you're doing the heel on the sock. Now the colors, one thing I really enjoy working with hand dyed yarn besides the way it feels and glides over your crochet hook is um, how you can mix up different color themes and how they all work out really beautiful together. So you have different colors of blues and turquoise, purples and browns and cream colors. So that's the um, yarn that we're gonna be using for this um, Get Hooked on Socks uh, Challenge. And then also that it was included in the pre-order um, box, you got a dragonfly stitch marker. Isn't that pretty? When I see dragonflies, I think of um, one of my first ever um, channels that I watch, the Crafty Dragonfly, and I'll leave her link below. She does beautiful work, and I really enjoy watching her channels. And then they left a card in here. Guess what? On September 10th, oh, we are launching the Get Hooked on Socks subscription box. Be one of the first to subscribe on our new website and receive a Hooked on Socks goodie bag in your first box. Every month you will receive one sock set and one new sock crochet pattern and it's uh, free shipping. And I'll leave Lether Collections um, information in the description box below. So I didn't know about this. They're starting up a new subscription box so they'll have two different types of subscription box on their website. So since I've never done socks before, after I crochet up these socks during the challenge, um, maybe next year, depending on how much I enjoyed making socks, I might consider um, 
joining up for their sock subscription. But we'll wait and see. I gotta see how much I like making socks. <laughs> and then I live in a, a hot climate and I don't wear socks very much. And then they also include um, the crochet pattern to make up the socks. So there's a close up of the socks that we'll be making. So what my plan is, is I will do um, a couple videos to show you the progress of how I'm doing on making up these socks. Um, so please leave in the description, in the comment section, let me know if you've ever crocheted or knitted socks and um, what your thoughts are. So again, I'll leave all this information in the description box if you're interested in signing up for their um, sock collection subscription. I went over to their website and took a photo to show you some of the crochet patterns that they have on sale. So here's a photo of some of their sock patterns. And here's a photo of some of the sock sets that they have on sale. So if you would like to take advantage to purchase any of these, I thought I'd just give you a heads up of what they have available. Another thing I like to purchase on Lethra Collection are their stitch markers. They make really cute and very well-made stitch markers. So let me show you what I, I purchased. I got this turtle. And then I got this cute little hedgehog. And I've noticed that hedgehogs are like a big thing in the yarny community. And then the last stitch marker I got this time around was a crescent moon with a cat. And of course, when I see a crescent moon, I have to buy it because that's my favorite moon when I see it up in the sky. Thank you for watching my channel. I'm having so much fun crocheting with you. Bye for now until we meet again.